Hey guys, Pella Fort here. In the last episode, we well, we start we kicked Venice out of Greece. We did that, but um, you know, we lost in Venice, so we're still suffering for that. I remember I went into Venice, tried to auto-resolve, and that didn't work, so then I recruited more people. We're going to see if they try to break out, and if they break out, if we can take them, but I doubt that. I don't know. Um, after Venice is done, well, we're probably going to go after Prussia, and then Sweden. Then I don't know if I'm even going to keep on playing after that, because... I think it'll be pretty accomplished, and I'll have the 40 territories needed to win. So, maybe... Okay, um... One of my plans was, um... Like, every now and then, after I finish a Let's Play, like after this one, I'm gonna go back to Super Mario 64 and do a video where I get... Uh, I'm gonna do the thing where I speed it up, and I'm gonna go to Rainbow Ride and get the highest amount of coins I can get. I'm not going to try to get every single one. Well, I'm going to try to, but that's not going to be my goal. My goal is going to be to get as many coins as I possibly can, personally, not in the game. I don't know if it'll be the most, but we'll see what happens with that. It's just a little experiment. And then later I'll come back and I'll do a video of me declaring war on France or something. I don't know. <laughs> What's going to be my next Let's Play? I don't know. I might go back to Nintendo 64 and do Paper Mario because I really like that game. I had some of my friends were like, you should do that. But at the same time, I might do something like Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga or even Fire Emblem. And then, like I said earlier, my every fourth Let's Play is going to be a Flash game. Just really quick one two series one two episode series and i think i'm gonna start with um seven deadly sins because i was playing that last night and i'm like yeah this would be good but the only thing is i would probably have to do something differently that time because um games like that are really like dialogue based and it's funny. You gotta hear it for it to be funny. Uh, mines that I'm not exploiting. I'll exploit those mines later, I guess. I don't know. Wow, that farm line's never upgraded. What to do? What to do? Wow, Catholicism really taken hold of Bosnia. And in Serbia, it's even less. I don't know. Beats me. Ah, oh, it's an echo effect, huh? Go ahead, Nyozo Kaja. Save state. Let's see what this does. Ah, that greatly increases my chances. Defeat. Well, shit. Okay, so if I attack Venice now, it wouldn't really work out for me, so I'm just going to recruit some more. And whoever I don't wind up using... We'll just go to fight Prussia. Okay, I gotta move those Greek troops. How many is it? It's a uh, half a stack. Should get there by 1929. Oh boy. So, I'll expand into Italy. Mm-hmm.
Let's see what happens in Venice now. I should win. And I lost. That's pretty inaccurate, I think. I don't think that would happen. Alright, so nothing's going well over there. Well, shit. Nothing's going right for me. You know, I just realized there's like some, some things, they just like put the city so perfectly that Prague to Munich is exactly one turn. It's weird. So I'll end the turn, see what happens if Venice tries to break out, if I can take them. And then I don't know what I'll do. It would be cool to finish it all up today. That would be nice. What is Spain doing? What are they up to? <sighs> so yeah, Venice has pretty much got me angry. F fucking shit, Ottoman traitors, you fuckers. They would just, uh, I bet they're waiting right outside of Istanbul. Fuck, this complicates things. Um, 
yeah, I, I'd like Russia to help me. What little chose? Who would do that? I gave you so much, you shitheads. And I never checked my prestige, which I forgot, because I was going to do that. God damn it, Turks. You just gotta declare war on me at the least opportune times, don't you? And then I gotta worry about Prussia. Then I gotta worry about Sweden. And even the Dutch have a chance of declaring war, 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 war on me. So, uh, Marathra is no more. But the Dutch still have Sri Lanka, and what is it, Mysore still exists. So, India is not united. Uh oh. Auto resolve, auto resolve, victory! Yes! Victory, victory! Hell, I might even make this video go on a little longer. I can speed up all the parts that I was silent. Because I was aggravated. It'll just be me recruiting in Istanbul and Athens and, you know, like, taking over Venice. Ooh, elections. I gotta make sure that came out right. Um, army, you could, you could be better. I'm sorry. Good, I like that. I like that you're a good guy to replace him. And I will check my prestige now. And only England is ahead of me. Um, they're kicking my ass in enlightenment and economy, but I'm by far the most militaristic nation ever. Okay, let's see what we got here. We can win. Take them over. Rebuild. Yeah, since Venice is 100% Catholic and they already have like a full scale happiness building, I'm not going to have to worry about anything they throw at me. So you go down here and fight the Turks. I don't know, I kept a sizable force, I guess. Um, you go there, I'll leave later, and you go up here. Greek army will go there. Holy shit, nine star general. Don't want to lose him. But then again, he is famous. Stanislav Poniatowski. Yeah, everybody knows him. And I'll also send you guys to Istanbul and Constantinople. And we'll see what else I can spend my money on next time. See you later, guys. This is Pelofort.